guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to be talking about my favorite thing. So the first thing on my list is Dr. Sebi's toothpaste powder. As you know, or some of you may know, or none of you may know, that I've gone completely alkaline with my diet. A quick review about the product. It's great, it's wonderful. It leaves my mouth feeling clean and smelling fresh, and there's no mint or spearmint or anything minty in it. It's actually not even white, which I thought it was going to be. So if you're into alkaline products or if you're trying to go alkaline, I suggest going to his website. The link will be in the description box below if you want to check it out. My second item is also another organic necess necess necessity words. Aesop's deodorant. They're an Australian brand and they focus on making their beauty products without harmful chemicals and things of that nature. And it's from nature. I think, I don't know. I'm not even sure how alkaline this product is, but I'll get into alkaline beauty and body products later on down the line. But for the time being, I've been using this for about a year since Thanksgiving. It was kind of expensive. I believe that it's $48. And I know that sounds pretty pricey for a deodorant, but you only need one spray per arm. And I've had it since November and I'm still not even close to finish with it. There'll be a link in the description box. It'll tell you how to use it and how to enjoy it. Well, the third item is another beauty product and that is Mango Butter. But the thing that I like about this, yeah, compared to like your shea butter and your coconut oil, it's not as oily, do you know what I mean? It's quite moisturizing on the skin but it doesn't leave it quite clammy and thick. Like I've said before, I'm sort of going alkaline if you will and mangoes are an alkaline fruit. So I wanted to try some alkaline butters and oils and so, um, mango butter, amazing, love it. My fourth and final beauty product is this clay. It's from like a Moroccan volcano, I don't know. There's a beauty page that I follow, this stunning woman who has sickening skin, and she used this product. It is for detoxifying the face. She mentioned this clay in one of her videos, and it's really good if you have clogged or oily skin. The thing that I like about it is, it doesn't feel like it's working. And then you rinse it off and it's like, oh my gosh, my skin, yes. Yeah, I'll link her video below as well as where you can purchase this clay. So my next item is body wash. But before I get into body wash, I have to talk about this tub stopper. My tub doesn't have the little thingamajig that like stops the water from going down. So I had to buy this online. I believe we ordered it on Amazon. I'll link that down below as well so that you can find it in case you're having a similar tub crisis as I was. Because I love taking baths and I used to go all the way to my aunt's house to take a bath. I really love it because I can enjoy baths in my own home. My next product are Jamia's Masterpiece. If you're not familiar with Yama Von Zant, she is a healer, pastor, and lawyer. You can find her on shows like Ayana Fix My Life. She fixed my life with these. Now, if you're not a fan or if you don't believe in like soaps and energy and soaps with energy, this is probably not gonna be your zhuzh. But if you are, listen up close. So these are masterpiece body washes and how they work are, they come with prayers. They're actually made with prayers as well. So each scent has a card and each card has the instructions on how you should enjoy your bath, affirmations that you should be saying and speaking into the universe so that you can get all the things that you desire and that you hope for. They are sold separately so you can pick like whatever you're feeling, if you need more energy, if you need more peace, if you need more tranquility, if you need more inspiration, you can buy them separately. But I bought the pack. If you wanna try them all like I did, you can get like a sample of all the different flavors and the body washes that she makes. Link in the description bar below. My next item is for my ladies, okay? And they are always tampons and pads. Let me tell you about this dynamic duo though. I've been using infinity pads for the longest time. They're super absorbent, they're amazing. You can put an entire flood of blood in this and it will not leak. And then I started trying out their tampons. I was not really a tampon girl before, a whole nother story but I now use their tampons and they come in a box with you can get light super regular and like super plus but the box size that I get are the regular and super they come combined half and half so so good look at how cute the packaging is I mean what now of course after talking about pads and tampons you need to be brave enough to do that and this is my current favorite book 
I haven't even finished reading it yet, but the thing that I love about this book is that it's all quotes. Your girl loves quotes, and especially quotes by Cheryl Strayed. And she's also the woman who walked. Reese Witherspoon played her in a movie called Walk, or The Walk, or Walking, or something like that. She took a walk, she found herself, and she also wrote this book. I picked this up from Urban Outfitters. It was the smooth $16.95. I want to say it was cheaper in Urban Outfitters because when I went to Strand Bookstore to pick up my next favorite thing, I was gonna get both, but I couldn't afford it because I believe this one was like $24 in Strand. But let's move on. This is my final favorite thing, and it is, it's really Elizabeth Gilbert. It's not necessarily this book. I just love Elizabeth Gilbert. She's like one of my favorite people right now. I'm obsessed. The book is pretty good. It's an easy read. It's super simple. I mean, you can breeze through this. The thing that I like about this book is that she created a podcast to go with it. That podcast I listen to religiously. It's pretty much church in my ears. Amazing. It's one of my favorite things and it stemmed from this book. So you kind of need the book and the podcast to go hand in hand. But if you want to just listen to the book, listen to the book. If you want to listen to the podcast, you can. And if you want to just read the book, you totally can. I picked this up at Strand Bookstore. It was $24.95. Now that is pretty expensive for a book especially when I usually buy my books used, but it comes out on paperback on the 27th, I believe. I will, of course, link it down below, and then you should follow Elizabeth on Instagram because she's one of my favorite people, one of my favorite authors, and one of my favorite podcasters. So, check it out. Wow, okay, yeah, that's literally everything. I hope this was informative. I hope that you had some takeaway, and I hope that you try some of these products. They're really good, really helpful. I use them on a regular basis, and they are really, indeed, my favorites. So, comment down below if you have any questions or concerns or curiosities. I'll be sure to respond to you guys. And again, as always, I will see you in another video.